after the second administration, when we had comparative anal analytical data to use, absolutely unbelievable. The dynamic that changed among these first year teachers when they all of a sudden saw growth, they saw comparative for students, oh, I see this, I understand this, how it works, and then the specificity. MAP has given us such actionable data that we can absolutely go down and drill down to specific teaks. So te the teachers talked about, we knew it, we knew it, we knew it, now we can show it. The biggest thing is we can talk about passing rates, we can talk about, oh, isn't that great? We've got 100% passing rate in fifth grade. Would you like to see my list of sixth grade teaks that need to be reinforced? Huge. Because passing's not enough. Passing's not enough. You're saying, great, you've got 60, but you passed star, that is awesome, pat ourselves on the back, we have a party. But that means that 40% of the teaks you didn't yeah, get. Yeah. And in math, next year, that, that leaky roof just gets a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger. So for us, that's what this data has done for us in the last four weeks, because it was mm -hmm. February, the, yeah. it was February, mm -hmm. January 25th, mm -hmm. when we did the data, 24th, we did the data day with these teachers. We broke it down, really started looking at everything, and we started immediately, immediately, and I'll show this data with you, but what we did as a district, we looked at this map data after the second administration, identified specific, specific things down to the individual teaks.